What an absolute ripper of a day it is here in the beautiful town of London. When the sun is out and the skies are blue here in London town, ladies and gentlemen, I invite you along with me to take a beautiful walk in my sanctuary in South London while I discuss with you today why I believe Bitcoin is going to the moon, ladies and gentlemen. What if, ladies and gentlemen, I told you that you might be able to purchase Bitcoin as well as some other of the main cryptocurrencies from none other than fintech giant PayPal, ladies and gentlemen. This is absolutely monstrous news for the crypto space. All that and more in today's episode. You can still enjoy this one. With the bilateral. And welcome friends to another episode of Bitcoin Zombie Investor, the channel where we know no matter how many times Bitcoin is supposedly sent to the grave, so to speak, it will always find a way to ah, crawl its way back to life. If you are new to the channel, then I welcome you. My name is Earl, and if you are returning, I love you. Thank you so much for your ongoing support in the early stages of Bitcoin Zombie Investor. If you're the kind of person that is interested in learning more about cryptocurrency, investing, finance, and how to just have a better wealth mindset, as well as seeing how it really looks to live a true life of passive income and financial freedom, and if you just wanna make a bit more money and get rich, so to speak, then make sure you leave a massive thumbs up and like the video. Make sure you take the time to subscribe to the channel and make sure you also hit that little notification bell on the side there to ensure that you don't miss when any future videos come out. For everybody watching the content today, new and old, I wanna just inform you that I run a strict no BS policy on this channel. All of the topics that I talk about on this channel are from personal in-depth research or personal experience first hand. That all being said, however, I am definitely not your or anyone else's financial advisor, and this is never financial advice. Do your own research, do your own due diligence. And guys, make sure you take the time and watch the video all the way through to the end. If you've got any questions or comments on the end of the video, please leave them there and I will make sure I respectfully get back to you as soon as I can. And if you do manage to do that, I will try my very best to leave one whole Bitcoin underneath your pillow tonight. A recent Coindesk article clearly suggests that based on their trusted resources that fintech giant PayPal could be making buying and selling of Bitcoin and cryptocurrency accessible to their customers sometime in the near future. It is rumored that this could happen within three months and that if it did, then Bitcoin buying would be accessible to PayPal's 325 million users worldwide. That is absolutely massive! It is still unclear at this point which specific cryptocurrencies would be available, but if I had to say, I would say you would definitely be able to at least purchase, buy and sell Bitcoin and Ethereum, as well as some of the other main cryptocurrencies, possibly in the top 10 market cap. Resources do suggest that there would be some kind of online wallet section on the PayPal app where cryptocurrency would be stored separately to fiat currencies. PayPal is currently supposedly in talks with numerous cryptocurrency exchanges worldwide to discuss which ones may have the most suitable and best liquidity for the platform. Hold your horses. Let's not get too excited. Let's focus on fact and fiction. PayPal have not officially come out and confirmed that this is actually happening. For now, it is still fiction. However, I'm going to detail for you now some clear reasons why I personally believe it is simply just a matter of time before PayPal do adopt this. The first reason is the simple fact that PayPal have had a good and healthy long-standing relationship since 2016 with arguably the biggest cryptocurrency exchange in the world and most definitely in the US of A. That exchange is Coinbase, ladies and gentlemen. The most trusted 
crypto exchange worldwide. In 2018, PayPal made fiat withdrawals from Coinbase to PayPal wallets possible. So in English, what I simply mean is people who bought Bitcoin from Coinbase could sell their Bitcoin from Coinbase and have their money put back into their PayPal account as well as their nominated bank account. This was a massive step in the pioneering and adoption of cryptocurrency. Reason number two. There is simply way too much money to be made in the fintech space for allowing users or customers to buy cryptocurrency off of these fintech platforms. Square. The payments unicorn launched by Twitter CEO Jack Dorsey in 2018 started launching Bitcoin purchases. In Square's most recent earnings report, they reported a total, wait for it, wait for it, 306 million US dollars in revenues from people purchasing Bitcoin on their platform. That is absolutely massive, people. Then, if we take a first-class flight all the way over to the sunny town of London, where I'm located right now, travel debit card company Revolut, which is fastly growing and expanding, partnered up in 2017 with cryptocurrency exchange Bitstamp. In February of 2020 alone, guess how much money Revolut raised from Bitcoin purchases on their platform. Remember, they've only been doing this from 2017 and have been one of the smartest early fintech company adopters of this idea. 500 million US dollars just in February. There is money in the space, people. Do I need to spell it out to you? A little analogy that I like to give is that fintech companies not adopting this new idea would simply be like you sitting at home and missing out on a gold rush if it was happening right outside your street. Come on, people. When PayPal come out and make this news official, Friends, think about what this means for the cryptocurrency space, mainstream adoption within that space, and a very special word which I like to call trust. Think about this, ladies and gentlemen. PayPal. People use PayPal because they trust PayPal. If there's an option to pay with PayPal, they know that that website can be trusted to an extent, okay? Now, people trust PayPal. PayPal trusts the purchase and use and the simple idea of Bitcoin. That is going to get the average user to adopt the idea of possibly purchasing at least some Bitcoin. This is absolutely redonkulous news. There is serious reason to just believe it is moon time, baby. People in this park are looking at me right now and they're thinking, man, this guy is the biggest loser I've seen today. But Who's the real loser? How many Bitcoin do they have? I'm stacking the sats. I got the Bitcoin in my pocket. I can almost say for sure that they probably don't. So who's the real loser? Ladies and gentlemen, if you are still here and you've watched the video all the way to the end, I appreciate you. If you have not done so already, please make sure you like the video, subscribe to the channel, and make sure you hit that notification bell to know when new videos do come out. If you have any comments or questions, please do leave them in the comments section below. If you really did enjoy the content today and you found some value here, make sure that you do share the video with some friends to learn a little bit more about wealth and cryptocurrency. And on top of that, if you are new to the space and you're looking to buy your first Bitcoin but you just don't know where to start, I will make it super easy for you. I will leave a link in the description below. It will be right on top and you'll be able to download the Crypto.com app and when you use my referral code and you choose to purchase a Ruby Red card, which I highly recommend you do by the way, or above, you will get $50 worth of free cryptocurrency straight into that app and account that you'll be able to use and you'll also be really supporting my channel by doing that. Also folks, before you head off and enjoy your day, whatever you may be doing, make sure you do check out this other video about the number one altcoin that you must simply own in 2024. Explosive gains, people. Make sure you check that video out. I will leave it just before the finish of this video today. That's it for now, folks, and peace out. Till next time.